In today's lesson, we're going to talk about how to subtract two fractions with unlike denominators. Let's subtract 5 eighths and 1 sixth. To subtract these two fractions, we need to find a common denominator. An easy way is to multiply the two denominators. 8 times 6 is 48. This may not be the least common denominator, but it works. Now we multiply the first fraction by the denominator of the second, and the second by the denominator of the first. So, we multiply the first fraction by 6 over 6, and the second fraction by 8 over 8. Now, let's multiply. 5 times 6 is 30. 8 times 6 is 48. 1 times 8 is 8. And 6 times 8 is 48. Now, both fractions have the same denominator. So, we subtract the numerators. 30 minus 8 is 22. So, the answer is 22 over 48. We can simplify it by dividing both numbers by 2. That gives us 11 over 24. Now, let's try another example. Let's subtract 5 sevenths and 1 sixth. The common denominator is 7 times 6, which is 42. We multiply the first fraction by 6 over 6. And the second fraction by 7 over 7. Now, let's multiply. 5 times 6 is 30. 7 times 6 is 42. 1 times 7 is 7. 6 times 7 is 42. Now that both fractions have the same denominator, we can subtract the numerators. 30 minus 7 is 23. So the final answer is 23 over 42. Now it's your turn. Try this problem on your own. What is 7 ninths minus 2 fifths? Take your time, pause the video if you need to, and when you're done, feel free to leave your answer in the comments. I'll be checking. If you found this video helpful, please consider giving it a like and sharing it with your friends. And if you want to keep learning more math with me, hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss any future lessons. Thanks again for watching. I'm James, and I'll see you in the next video.